In this video, I'm going to go through the solutions to the questions on polynomial long division. A reminder, if you haven't already tried these questions, you can find a link to those in this video's description. So for this first question, we're going to draw a bus stop, we'll write the cubic inside and the linear term outside. We divide x cubed by x, which gets x squared, and then we multiply x squared back through by this linear term. x squared times x is x cubed, and x squared times 2 is plus 2x squared. Now we subtract these two x cubed take x cubed is 0, 9x squared takes 2x squared is 7x squared. Then bring down the next term, that's this plus 26x, and then do 7x squared divide by x, which is plus 7x. Now multiply back through, so plus 7x times by x plus 2. 7x times x is 7x squared, and 7x times 2 is plus 14x. Now we subtract. 7x squared takes 7x squared is 0, 26x take 14x is 12x. Then bring down the next term, and we'll do 12x divide by x, which gives you plus 12. Then multiply back through, plus 12 times x plus 2, 12 times x is 12x, 12 times 2 is 24, and if you subtract these you get 0. So we have our answer, which is the quadratic at the top, x squared plus 7x plus 12. So for this one, we'll do a bus stop, we'll put the cubic inside, and the linear term outside. Now we do x cubed, divide by x, which is x squared, and then multiply the x squared back through. So x squared times x is x cubed, x squared times 5 plus 5x squared. Now we subtract these two. x cubed take away x cubed is 0, 8x squared take 5x squared is 3x squared. Now I'll bring down the next term, that's this plus 17x. Do 3x squared divide by x, which is plus 3x, and then multiply that plus 3x back through. 3x times x is 3x squared, 3x times plus 5 is plus 15x. Now subtract. 3x squared take 3x squared is 0, and 17x take 15x is 2x. Bring down the final term, that plus 10. Do 2x divide by x, which gets you plus 2, and now multiply that 2 back through. 2 times x is 2x and 2 times plus 5 is plus 10. Then subtract these, and you'll get 0. So we finished, and the answer is this quadratic, x squared plus 3x plus 2. For this one, we draw a bus stop. Inside goes the cubic, and in the front goes the linear term. Start with x cubed divided by x, which is x squared, then multiply that back through. x squared times x is x cubed, x squared times 2 is plus 2x squared. Now subtract these x cubed take x cubed is 0, and 5x squared take 2x squared is 3x squared. Bring down the next term, the plus 2x, and do 3x squared divide by x, which is plus 3x. Then multiply this 3x back through. 3x times x is 3x squared, 3x times 2 is plus 6x, and now we subtract. So 3x squared take 3x squared is 0, and 2x take 6x is negative 4x. Bring down the final term, the negative 8, negative 4x divided by x is negative 4. Multiply negative 4 back through, negative 4 times x, negative 4x, and negative 4 times a positive 2 is a negative 8. If you subtract these, you get 0, so the answer is this quadratic, x squared plus 3x, take 4. For this one, we do the bus stop, the cubic inside, and the linear term outside. x cubed divided by x is x squared, Multiply the x squared back through, x squared times x is x cubed, x squared times negative 3, negative 3x squared. Now we subtract these. We need to be careful, x cubed take x cubed is 0, negative 4x squared take away, and negative 3x squared is actually negative x squared. Then bring down the plus x. Negative x squared divided by x is negative x. Then multiply negative x back through, negative x times x is negative x squared, negative x times negative 3 is plus 3x. Subtract these, the negative x squareds will cancel, x take away 3x is negative 2x. Then bring down the plus 6, negative 2x divided by x is negative 2, multiply this negative 2 back through, negative 2 times x is negative 2x, negative 2 times negative 3 is positive 6. If you subtract these, you'll get 0, so the answer is this quadratic, x squared, take away x, take away 2. Inside the bus stop goes the cubic, and outside the linear term. 
do 2x cubed divide by 2x, which is x squared. Multiply x squared back through. x squared times 2x is 2x cubed. And x squared times 1 is plus x squared. Now do a subtraction. The 2x cubes will cancel, and 7x squared take away x squared is 6x squared. Bring down the next term, negative 17x. Now we've got 6x squared divided by 2x, which gives you a positive 3x. Multiply this 3x back through. 3x times 2x is 6x squared, and 3x times 1 is plus 3x. We'll subtract these. 6x squareds will cancel. Negative 17x take away 3x is negative 20x. Bring down the final term, this negative 10. Negative 20x divided by 2x gives you negative 10. Now multiply this negative 10 back through. Negative 10 times positive 2x is negative 20x. Negative 10 times 1 is negative 10. You subtract these and you get 0. So the final answer is x squared plus 3x take away 10. We'll put the cubic inside the bus stop and the linear term outside. And do 3x cubed divided by 3x which gets you x squared. Then multiply x squared back through. x squared times 3x is 3x cubed. x squared times 2 is plus 2x squared. Subtract these. 3x cubes will cancel. Negative 4x squared take 2x squared is negative 6x squared. Bring down the next term, negative 13x. Do negative 6x squared divided by 3x, which gives you negative 2x, and multiply this negative 2x back through. Negative 2x times 3x is negative 6x squared, and negative 2x times plus 2 is negative 4x. Then subtract these. Negative 6x squareds will cancel. Negative 13x take away, and negative 4x is negative 9x. Bring down the next term. Negative 9x divided by 3x gives you negative 3. Multiply this back through. Negative 3 times 3x is negative 9x and negative 3 times positive 2 is negative 6. Subtract these and you get 0. And there's our final answer. x squared take 2x take 3. We'll put the cubic inside the bus stop and the linear term outside. Do 2x cubed divide by x, which gives you 2x squared. Multiply 2x squared back. 2x squared times x is 2x cubed. 2x squared times 5 is plus 10x squared. We subtract these. 2x cubes will cancel. 9x squared take 10x squared is negative 1x squared. Bring down the next term, negative 11x. Now negative x squared divided by x is negative x. Multiply this back through. Negative x times x, negative x squared. And negative x times positive 5 is negative 5x. We'll subtract these. Negative x squareds will cancel. Negative 11x take away negative 5x is negative 6x. Bring down the final term. Negative 6x divided by x is negative 6. Multiply this negative 6 back through. Negative 6 times x is negative 6x. And negative 6 times positive 5, negative 30. And if you subtract these, you get 0. So we have our final answer. 2x squared take x, take 6. We put the cubic inside the bus stop and the linear term outside. We'll do 4x cubed divided by 2x which gives you 2x squared. Multiply this back through. 2x squared times 2x is 4x cubed, and 2x squared times negative 1 is negative 2x squared. Subtract these, the 4x cubes will cancel, and then we've got 16x squared, take away negative 2x squared, gives you 18x squared. Bring down the next term. We'll do 18x squared divided by 2x, which gets you 9x, and then multiply this back through. 9x times 2x is 18x squared, and 9x times negative 1 is negative 9x. We'll subtract these. 18x squareds will cancel. Negative x take away negative 9x is a positive 8x. Bring down the final term, the negative 4. Do 8x divided by 2x, which is plus 4. And multiply that back through. 4 times 2x is 8x. And 4 times negative 1 is negative 4. Subtract these and you get 0. So our final answer, 2x squared plus 9x plus 4. We put the cubic inside the bus stop and the linear term outside. We do x cubed divided by x, which is x squared, and multiply this x squared back through. x squared times x is x cubed. x squared times plus 3 is plus 3x squared. Now we subtract these terms. The x cubes will cancel. 8x squared take away 3x squared is 5x squared. 
Now we bring down the next term, which is plus kx. We do 5x squared divided by x, which is plus 5x, and multiply this plus 5x back 3. 5x times x is 5x squared, and 5x times 3 is plus 15x. Now we subtract. The 5x squareds will cancel. Then we need to do kx take away 15x, which will be k minus 15, lots of x. Now we bring down the final term, the plus 12, and we need to do k minus 15 lots of x divided by x. Well, if you do this, the x's will just cancel and you're left with a term k minus 15. Multiply this k minus 15 back through. k minus 15 times x is k minus 15 lots of x, and k minus 15 times 3 is plus 3 lots of k minus 15. And now we'll subtract these. Now we know when we subtract these, we need to get 0. The reason is we're told there's no remainder in this question. If you do k minus 15x take k minus 15x, you do get 0. And the only way for 12 take away 3 lots of k minus 15 to be 0 is if this 12 is equal to this 3k minus 15. So let's write that out as an equation. 12 equals 3 lots of k minus 15. If we expand the right hand side, we get 3k minus 45. If we then add 45 to both sides, we get 57 equals 3k and then divide both sides by 3, you'll get k equals 19, which is the answer to the question. For this question, notice we don't actually have a cubic. The highest power here is 4. In fact, there's no x cubed term at all. What we'll do for this question is draw a bus stop, and we'll write this polynomial in here, but we'll recognise the fact that there are 0 x cubes in here by writing plus 0 x cubed. This isn't strictly necessary, but it really helps to organise your working. And then the linear term goes at the front. We do 2x to the 4 divided by x, which is 2x cubed. Multiply 2x cubed back through. 2x cubed times x is 2x to the 4, and 2x cubed times negative 2 is negative 4x cubed. Now we subtract these. 2x to the 4s will cancel, and then we have 0x cubed take away negative 4x cubed, which gives you a positive 4x cubed. Then bring down the next term. Now we'll do 4x cubed divided by x, which is positive 4x squared. Multiply that back through. 4x squared times x is plus 4x cubed, and 4x squared times negative 2 is negative 8x squared. Now we subtract these. The 4x cubes will cancel. Negative 10x squared take away negative 8x squared is negative 2x squared. Bring down the next term, and do negative 2x squared divided by x, which gets you negative 2x. Multiply that negative 2x back through, you get negative 2x squared plus 4x. We subtract these, the negative 2x squareds will cancel, and then 3x take 4x is negative x. Bring down that final term plus 2, and we do negative x divided by x, which is negative 1. Multiply that back through, negative 1 times x is negative x, and negative 1 times negative 2 is positive 2. Subtract these and you'll get 0. And there we have it, the answer is 2x cubed plus 4x squared, take away 2x, take away 1. Thank you for watching this video, I hope you found it useful. Check out what I think you should watch next and subscribe so you don't miss out on future videos.